<clears throat> All right, guys, welcome back to the episode. So this time we're mowing Leroy's lawn. And I got gas for his mower. I serviced it last year, so just going to pull the dipstick. Looking pretty clean. I doubt that he mowed with it too often, and his yard's not too big. So we're going to see if we can get the girl fired up. <clears throat> in the clutch battery's pretty low Let's see if we can. there we go we got her park um, I'm sure I'm gonna check for loose terminals yeah I'm sure Leroy's got a battery somewhere or a jump pack so, having some Taco Bell still, having lunch at supper time, because that's how we roll, two meals a day, I guess. <laughs> All right, so this is the yard. <clears throat> I've been around and trimmed the pine trees. Hey, he's got this washed. This is pretty uh, muddy from last weekend. So I got all the low hanging pines trimmed. I did forget my stupid um, tripod, so we're gonna have to get creative with the camera angles. All right, we did the old two-handed jump start, so now we're ready to ride. Oh, yep, this still works. Runs a little bit the way it does, but hey. Eh? I think we're on to something. We're gonna start all the way up by the road and work our way back. I got my little tripod, so maybe we can do some shots along the, uh, uh, off the driveway. There's a rock here. Corners all the way down. Yeah, this is a tiny one. 38 inches, got a little on a push mower. But yeah, we're gonna eat, we're gonna mulch up all the pine branches. And if there's any significant uh, leftovers, I'll take those out back on the little brush pile. So let's get to mowing. Whoa, clutch break, which is.
All right, guys, I guess just got done. Uh, looked at my time. It took me a little over two hours to get everything mowed, which is kind of surprising. But then again, it's a 38-inch mower, and it's a manual shift, and that takes a lot of time because you got to decide whether to shift it up a few gears and push it through a, a easy patch or just wait it out. So looks nice. Trees are all trimmed back. I threw some of the sticks over by the last tree. And even the rough spot out back is all mowed. There was lots and lots of tree bark on the ground. I think they, well, they cleaned up some of the fence row about behind. And that was some of the dirt and bark. But there must have been some down trees that they dragged. There's this one pile of bark and stuff there that I mowed a bunch of. I figured the neighbors would come yelling at me because I was making tons and tons of dust. So, probably not the most ideal day, but we got her done. And now everything looks nice and tidy. So I weed eater the ditches and then I took her out a walk around the house. And the propane tank. And that was about it. Alright guys, see you in the next one.